What if a building could touch the clouds? Saudi Arabia has set its sights on creating the tallest skyscraper ever built, a tower that will rise two kilometers into the sky. That's twice as tall as the Burj Khalifa. But is this just a dream, or can it become reality? This ambitious project promises to break records, turn heads, and reshape how we think about architecture. Yet, there's so much we don't know. Why is Saudi Arabia building this skyscraper? What challenges will it face? And most importantly, can this mega project succeed where others have failed? Stick around to uncover the full story. The Kingdom's Bold Vision Saudi Arabia is no stranger to bold ideas. Over the last few decades, the country has transformed its deserts into bustling cities, futuristic hubs, and architectural marvels. Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman has been the driving force behind these ambitious projects, using the nation's immense oil wealth to fund a vision of a modern, cutting-edge kingdom. From the line, a 170-kilometer-long futuristic city, to the luxurious Red Sea resorts, Saudi Arabia's plans always aim to impress. But this new skyscraper might be its most ambitious project yet. If built, the two-kilometer tower will dwarf every other structure on Earth, making it a symbol of power and innovation. This isn't just about breaking records, it's about sending a message to the world. Saudi Arabia wants to prove that it's ready to lead the future of architecture and urban living. But ambition isn't enough. Building something of this scale comes with challenges, many of which the kingdom has faced before. What do we know so far? The news about this mega tower broke earlier this year, and details are still scarce. Here's what we know. The building will rise two kilometers high, twice the height of the Burj Khalifa in Dubai. It will be located near Riyadh, close to King Salman International Airport. We don't know what the tower will be used for. Will it house offices, apartments, or luxury hotels? Or will it serve as a mixed-use space, like other iconic skyscrapers? Even the design remains a mystery, as no concept art or blueprints have been revealed. What we do know is that this project will cost billions of dollars. Saudi Arabia has hired some of the best architects and engineers in the world to make it happen. But is it possible to build a structure this tall? Let's find out. The challenges of building so high. Building a two-kilometer skyscraper is no small feat. The first challenge is engineering. A building this tall must withstand strong winds, extreme heat, and the sheer weight of its materials. Designers will need to come up with new techniques to keep the structure stable and safe. Another challenge is transporting materials. Construction will require moving massive amounts of steel, concrete, and glass to incredible heights. Special elevators and cranes will be needed, technology that may need to be invented just for this project. Then there's the human factor. Living and working in such a tall building brings unique problems. How will people move between floors quickly? How will natural light reach the center of the tower? And in an emergency, how will people evacuate? These are questions that must be answered before construction even begins. Why build it? The power of ambition. Saudi Arabia's two-kilometer skyscraper is not just a building. It's a symbol of the country's future. For decades, Saudi Arabia's economy has depended on oil. But now, the world is moving toward renewable energy and sustainable solutions. This means Saudi Arabia must find new ways to grow its economy. This skyscraper is part of that plan. By building the tallest building in the world, Saudi Arabia wants to show that it is a country of innovation and ambition. The tower is meant to attract businesses, investors, and tourists. It will become a global landmark, showing the world that Saudi Arabia is ready for the future. There's also the factor of competition. Countries like the UAE and China are constantly building taller and more impressive skyscrapers. By creating this record-breaking tower, Saudi Arabia aims to stay ahead in the race and claim its spot as a global leader in architecture and technology. What can go wrong? Lessons from the past. Building such a massive project is not easy, and Saudi Arabia has faced challenges with similar plans before. For example, the Jeddah Tower, which was planned to be one kilometer tall, started construction in 2013. However, the project faced many delays due to funding issues and other problems. 
Today, it remains unfinished. Another example is Neom, a futuristic city that promised incredible features like AI-powered infrastructure and floating islands. While Neom sounded amazing on paper, the high costs and technical challenges forced the project to be scaled back. These examples show that even with a lot of money and ambition, building megaprojects is very complicated. For the two-kilometer skyscraper, the risks are even higher. It will require advanced engineering, new technologies, and a huge budget. If the planning isn't perfect, the project could face delays or even fail altogether. Saudi Arabia will need to learn from its past mistakes to make this tower a success. The cost of ambition. The cost of building this skyscraper will be enormous. Experts estimate that it could cost more than $15 billion. While Saudi Arabia has a lot of money from its oil wealth, projects like this can quickly become very expensive. But the cost doesn't end with construction. Maintaining such a massive building will require a lot of money. For example, keeping the building cool in the desert heat, cleaning thousands of windows, and running elevators that reach 2 kilometers high will be very costly. These expenses could add up over the years. Despite these challenges, Saudi Arabia believes that this investment will pay off in the long run. The tower could bring in new businesses, increase tourism, and improve the country's global reputation. If everything goes as planned, the benefits might outweigh the high costs. A glimpse into the future. If this skyscraper is completed, it will change how we think about cities and architecture. Imagine a building so tall it becomes its own ecosystem, with homes, offices, parks, and even schools inside. It could redefine urban living, offering a solution to overcrowding in cities. But the tower's impact will go beyond its height. It will inspire engineers and architects worldwide to push the limits of what's possible. New materials, technologies, and designs will emerge, shaping the future of construction. Most importantly, it will prove that even the boldest dreams can become reality, with enough vision, resources, and determination. Reaching for the sky. Saudi Arabia's two-kilometer skyscraper is more than just a building, it's a statement. It shows the world that the kingdom is ready to lead in innovation and architecture. But whether this project succeeds or faces setbacks, it will spark conversations, inspire ideas, and push the boundaries of what we can achieve. So, what do you think? Can Saudi Arabia turn this dream into reality? Or is it too ambitious to succeed? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fascinating stories about the world's biggest projects. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.